Art of Ideas Gallery and Heritage Home is located in St. Mary's, Ontario, and it's the dream child of the artist Eugene Florence Zanfirescu and myself, and we worked to acquire this dream for uh, over 25 years. And in a nutshell, it is an art gallery and it contains all Florence artwork, painting, sculpture, photography, and installation art, as well as a heritage home, one of the most beautiful in, uh, in this area. It's a house that was built in 1880 and it's in pristine condition now in 2022. We have a collection of paintings that I have worked to over 25 years. They are trying to tell a story that usually is done during the movies, sci-fi movies or sci-fi books. And as far as we know, we are the only place on earth at the moment that a painter is describing the history of civilization in new terms and depicts the present and our challenges. And in, in the same time, we are trying to predict a very possible future. You have here two immigrants, two newcomers to Canada with a very big dream. And that dream was to have our own gallery space, our own museum, and to have all Florence art inside that museum for people to see. You have an artist in 21st century that started this very difficult and challenging road of creating art. Each, each painting takes about a year to create and then deciding not to sell it, but actually to display it and have the public being able to see it. And the beauty about that is that you can see that inside a beautiful home from 1880s, who is in, in that same condition. The woodwork is uh, the original one, the uh, hardwood floors, the architecture, like it's lots to see and take in. I know in the past when we were looking for inspiration, we loved Dali. Uh, he has an amazing museum north of Barcelona in what was a very small fisherman town. And he and his wife bought this villa. They lived there, but then they, uh, they made it into a museum and the museum is now uh, being seen by over one million people every year. So we have three rooms downstairs that we transformed them in galleries, real art galleries, and another three galleries upstairs. The galleries downstairs are concentrating on presenting a new view about history. We are getting rid of geography, we are getting rid of name of kings, date of birth, wars, and we are concentrating only on the things that we as humans, we have achieved or failed. So each painting is surrounded by a series of transformation factors that uh, describes a, a certain period in the history of humanity. So the whole history of humanity is sliced in two big portions. And I have decided to use the metaphors of ships for the stages of humanity as the ships are developing. So the humanity. So there are parallels between humanities, between the history of us and the history of the ships, how the ships are being built and they are conquering the world and they are failing sometimes. They are getting lost at sea, so do the civilizations. And also there is the parallel with the machines. Machines are having their own history alongside us. They develop themselves with our help. Sometimes in the future, this is the story of the upper three galleries. Sometimes in the future, we think that uh, humans will be replaced by those machines and machines will be able to develop themselves and conquer the universe. Because if this won't happen, we will be trapped on this planet and we will die eventually with the planet at the end of the sun. 
for everyone or anyone who uh, would like information on Art of Ideas Gallery and Heritage Home, we have a website www.artofideasgallery.com. Uh, we also have a Facebook page and an Instagram account at Art of Ideas Gallery, so it's easy to find us. And on all those three platforms, people can find out information on the gallery itself, the historical house, the artist, his art, his concepts, as well as how you can book tours 